better. Hey friends, welcome to the channel, welcome to the video. My name is Steven and I am a second year dental student and I am vlogging the day today, a full day here in dental school. Today's gonna be interesting because we are actually back to pre-COVID normalcy. We have mandatory lectures, we have full labs. So basically I'm gonna be on campus all day for school, which is something that I'm still getting used to having been a COVID dental student for the last year and a half. And I'm gonna be bringing you along with me throughout the day. We have two two-hour lectures and then a standard four-hour lab. And then we also have a test coming up early next week in a couple of days. So I have a massive amount of things to study and you'll see me hitting the Anki and Remnote quite frequently throughout the day. But basically I'm just starting out the morning with some coffee as you can see. I'm also gonna make a little bit of breakfast and then we'll get to campus and get these lectures going. Oh, you sit in the seat for me? Yeah, Steven, are you vlogging? So nice. I am vlogging. I'm vlogging. Isn't it funny how you like, you get those one, that one friend around and everybody just start acting stupid? Like Steven or Jacob or something like that. It's like you have a completely... My name, is, my name is being slandered at the moment. Well... Say hello. Hey, how's it going? There we go. That's Mike. He's a real sweetheart. One handsome devil, you might say. One handsome devil, that's right. A few moments later. What you doing, dude? Um, well... Is that a donut? It is a donut. Is it good? Hell yeah, it's good. Can so I have, as can he's I doing a skit night or a skit video, oh, and I'm so not in it. I showed up to go get a donut and not watch the skit video. <laughs> the donut was good though. I don't have any lunch. You want to eat some pasta with me? Yes. I literally, I have so much food. Because otherwise, I'm, I'm like, I don't know what to do. Because Jacob got the last chicken pot pie. <laughs> are we gonna do like a? What are you eating? Yeah. Video. When you haven't been to the store in a week, meal. I know you loved Hot Pockets as a kid. Yeah, so why are you, why are you making me, why are you shaming me? I'm not. Oh, here, put it on this, that way. It doesn't, Thanks, like, Dad. seep out all over you. You're not touching it. That's f***ing gross, dude. What? <laughs> what is? That you just set, it's just, like, sitting on the bottom of the it's microwave. In the, it's in the cardboard. Yeah, but the edges of it. At this point, I mean, I'm just—I just need some some sort of food in my body. Yeah. I think Will's being a hater. I'm not being a hater. I love hot pockets. You're being a hater, bro. He tried to sit this on the bottom of the microwave that 8,000 people use. It's disgusting. Shredding me. Stop being shreddable. Civilized people <laughs> eat real food. Civilized people who went to the store in the past couple days. Or well, that sounds like a personal problem. It is a personal problem. I'm really upset about it. Oh, look at this. Bro, I just want to go home, get naked, and eat my chicken pot pie. Oh, <laughs> that was so out of pocket. <laughs> Literally, yes. Cold pasta. This is this is what it takes Absolute, to look like Absolute this, bro. bro lunch. Cold pasta and a chicken pot pie. Mm. Surprising amount of protein in that. What is it, like 18? Oh! Oh! oh 17 my grams, goodness baby. gracious. Did I just open the doors? I almost got crazy. blown off of this. This. Whatever this is. Ledge. Almost died. That would have been a crazy Dude, video know, to drop. You know who's You're gonna be really upset that he didn't get invited to this? Lane. 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 <laughs> Sometimes in dental school you just <laughs> Do it! Do it. <laughs> We had two lectures, uh, what were they? Pain control and, and, and pediatric dentistry. 
I haven't even talked to the camera all day, that's why I'm doing this. And then we have uh, RPD lab here in a couple minutes. Let's get after it, boys. Oh, get ready I to learn. Gonna... <laughs> I just, I just flinched so bad. I thought you were gonna punch me or something. <laughs> Becca, this is like video. It's your time to shine. Hello. Everyone, this is Becca. She's been in my vlogs a lot, but, <laughs> my, top of my head. but never been yeah. in, 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 in them. I'm always in the background right here. Yeah, just, just, get, just getting that work yeah. in. So, it looks hard. It's actually uh, Alcantara. I don't know if you're familiar with nice materials. No, never heard of it. I wouldn't expect a pleb like you to know what that is, but... It's, it's velour. Yeah. <laughs> this actually, I ripped this out of the headrest of my Koenigsegg and put it on my durag. I made this from the skin of a seal. Like <laughs> dumb stuff for one day. This vlog is going to be fire. <laughs> No distractions, Jacob. Yeah, let's kill it, bro. I like to find undercuts by taking my cast. And you just want to look at it straight on. Anywhere you see shadows is an undercut. I like to find metaphorical undercuts. <laughs> Where am I lacking in life? <laughs> Who's a gunner? I'm a lab gunner. Did you ever have a chemistry course? Why are you holding it so low? I don't even know if these are actually undercuts. I'm just putting a bunch of wax there. Yes. There are a few things I enjoy oh my gosh. in middle school as much as finding undercuts and filling them with wax. <laughs> Actually, I like everything else better. Yeah, the doctor already said I can do everything but squat and run. Can't be a baby back bitch. Dude, one of my, <laughs> one of my, um... <laughs> wow, Jacob. I, I mean, I would expect Steven to laugh at that, but I wouldn't expect you to laugh at someone else getting to make fun of. <laughs> Right Bro, now. you told me you like someone else's dog better than mine. Like, yeah, no, you're on his shit. I've been so mad about that. Bro, I can't hold on to Clayton. I was like, you know who pissed me off the time? Wait, 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 wait. What is it? Wait, I'll tilt it this way, maybe? Yes, sir. All right. Maybe get that a little bit lower. Pretty decent. We're going to smooth up the edges with a slow speed hand piece anyway, so yeah. don't really can't need to jagged edges. Of that. Wait, that was pretty bad. Not really. I was mad that we didn't get our subway today. Yeah, there he is. He's I gonna went, be on the vlog. Finally. I went to finally. Subway. You went to Subway? Yep. Damn, I should've gone. Where'd he come? I had a hot pocket for lunch. So we got this finished and cured. The next step of this is trimming this cast up a bunch. Like this. And then after that, we would, we're gonna be using basically a Play-Doh-like material. And then we're beating and boxing. So there's a lot left to this project, but it's not due for a while, so. Walk over and play basketball. I'm going home. Oh, I thought you said you swim basketball. No, he, he's not for the boys, but. Oh, uh, this is for the boys? <laughs> All right, let's go. Kids, don't leave lab early. It's a really bad thing to do. Don't ever do this. Oh, we going for it? There is currently a tornado warning in Memphis, Tennessee. As dental students, we're really concerned with health. We wouldn't have gotten into the medical field if we weren't. So the safest thing we could possibly do right now is ball out, baby! <laughs> Everybody, this is John. Ex Hooper turned dentist. Hey, how's dental school going? Uh, pr pretty well, as you can see here. Yeah, we don't have to take it too serious. It's pretty easy. <laughs> you know what I mean? You can just hoop whenever. So, good stuff, baby. Good stuff, yeah. Good stuff. the master, you so, know that. So, I'm gonna be out here every single day, mark my words, I'm gonna get better, I'm gonna come out and show these boys how to do it. I'll try, I feel like you're here for it. Alright, one, uh... <laughs> 
Alright, uh, there we go. Well, that was a blast. Uh, we played a game of just like pick up three on three with some of the D4s and it about killed me, but it was fun. I enjoyed it. We had a good time and uh, it's really nice to break these, these long days up with something like that. We just spent like an hour out there. The weather is crazy right now. It's like borderline tornado watch here in Memphis. I've got a lot more to do in this day. But my biggest problem right now is that I have no food, basically. So, especially with how many calories I burned in, in that basketball game, I'm thinking I'm gonna wanna get a good dinner in before this study session. I have a lot of work to do with my classes for this test. So, I think the plan is to shower up and then go get some dinner, and then I will meet back up with you guys at the desk and I'll kind of show you what the studying is looking like for this exam that we have in a few days, because I feel like I haven't really shown that in a while on the vlogs. Yeah, so remember when I said that I needed to get dinner? This is literally the worst day to possibly run out of food, because apparently there's a tornado outside. I'm so hungry. <laughs> Okay, so after a few hours, I am back and I ended up actually braving the storm and going to get some food because I was well and truly out of everything edible in my apartment. I went and got some food, I had some dinner, and I wanted to show you a little bit of what I've been working on in school because I feel like in my vlogs lately, I've had a whole lot of fun stuff, a whole lot of just showing you about what it's like to be a dental student, but I haven't really shown you a lot of the study side of it lately. So I've mentioned this a few times, but we have an exam coming up in a few days. And as they always do at my school, this exam covers a lot of material. Basically at my school, we put all of our course subjects together into big exams called PAR exams. Basically each test covers essentially a month of material. It's like six to eight classes. So we have tons of different lectures uh, that span throughout this entire month and we have all of these different classes to cover for one exam. So organization is really important and I just wanted to show you what I've been doing here. This is my RimNote and I've talked a little bit about RimNote and Anki on my channel lately. I use both of them, I'm using both for this exam, but specifically for this exam, I've been enjoying RimNote because of the organization that you get with this app. So basically over here on the side, you can see I have my PAR decks. Now these are PAR exams once again, but within Par 3, you can see all the different courses here. We have endodontics, operative, oral implantology, oral surgery, pain control, you get the gist. And each of these folders for the class has lectures within them. So you can go through and see some of the, the notes slash cards that I made on each one. What you see here is essentially my card making process for all of these different courses. And to study, I basically go over to flashcards. I go up here and I just hit Par 3 and I get all of the cards that I've made for this exam. They're all mixed in together randomly, which I like, and it's really a nice way to study. Now, as I said, I'm also using Anki for this exam. Um, I'm gonna be going through, and I have a few Anki decks that I'm gonna be cycling through in the next couple of days, but basically this is just the process. The difficulty with things these days is that we are fully back on campus. So on a day like today, last year as a D1, or even last semester, I would have spent this entire morning studying. Unfortunately, the side effect of going to campus and spending time in lectures is that there's a lot of time spent sitting in a lecture hall, listening to something that isn't directly applicable to a, the test that's coming up. So that's kind of the difficulty that we're all facing right now. Basically, we have less free time or less time to use to study in preparation for these exams. It's a little bit of an adjustment period for me and my classmates, uh, but hopefully we're able to go through that adjustment gracefully. I got a lot done today. Today was, uh, generally speaking, a very productive day, pretty much a typical day in the life of a second year dental student. Guys, thank you so much for watching this video and, and all my other videos if you've checked them out. I really have fun doing these vlogs and they just mean a lot to me to just kind of take the camera around and show you. I know some of it seems like it's very trivial, like me and my buddies in the vending machine room. But in all honesty, years from now, when I look back at dental school, I will have the luxury of having all of these little moments captured in, in vlog form. So I'm super excited about that. And I'm excited for the content to impact you. If you're looking to go to dental school and you're wanting to see what it's like to be a dental student, hopefully I'm giving you a decent idea of what the whole experience is like. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you like the video. 
YouTube really appreciates that and uh, subsequently I do as well. And also subscribe to the channel because I always have videos coming out. I'm doing a video a week, so you don't wanna miss anything. Subscribing is the best way to do that. Stay tuned for everything that's coming in the future and I truly appreciate you all, my friends. You mean the world to me. I'm gonna wrap it up here. As I always say at the end of my videos, I will see you in the next one. Thank you.